Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a, another grocery haul. Uh, this is what we got from Walmart today. As you can see, I did not get any produce from Walmart. Um, I'm getting that from Harris Teeter later on, and you'll see that in the same video when I, um, after I go. Anyway, guys, this is everything that we got. Um, not, not too much. I, I want to say I spent maybe $120. So, my husband wanted some more Oreos. You guys, I'm trying my best not to put vegan junk in my body anymore. Um, so, these are for my husband. And sometimes Jackson will eat these, but definitely not for me. I've been trying not to eat those. Um, my husband likes this Orgain Organic um, Protein Powder. He puts this in his smoothies. I usually just buy the va vanilla bean one. Um, he likes to put that in his smoothies. And then... I got this McCormick One Sheet Pan Farmer's Market uh, Chicken and Vegetable Seasoning. Obviously, you don't need to put it on chicken. Um, this is really good. I use maybe a third of the packet every time I roast. Like, I'll chop up a whole ton of vegetables and roast them in the oven with some of this and some olive oil on it. Really good. Um, and then two boxes of Cheerios. I got the family size. My husband's been eating a lot of Cheerios lately, too. And then, you guys, I don't know why I picked up the Mega Size a cinnamon toast crunch but I did anyway I got this party size smart food popcorn for Jackson and then I got this bag of walnuts uh, just for some baking and then I'll probably use some of these in my date ball recipe that I'm going to be making soon um, and then I got two boxes of the Bigelow chamomile vanilla herbal tea my husband loves to have this tea every morning um, it is his favorite so I got two boxes of that for him and then I got two Lunchables, one with the Oreo um, in it, and then I got the other one with the chocolate chip cookie, so Jackson has a choice. I'm sorry. Okay, anyway guys, I don't know where I was. Lunchables for Jackson. And then I got these Field Roast Classic Smoked Plant-Based Frankfurters. A lot of people say these um, are the best when it comes to vegan hot dogs, so we figured we'd try them out since our Walmart actually started carrying them now. Um, yeah, I don't really know. If they're good or not, we usually just buy the Light Life ones. And yeah, they're not the best, but they're tolerable when you really want a hot dog. So anyway, we're definitely going to try those out. I got some more of the Nasoya uh, Super Firm Tofu. This is my favorite one to buy. And then, okay, so I ordered two of the Indian, uh, the vegetable korma, like this one down here. And I guess they only had the one. So they gave me this matar paneer i don't know how to say it um this has cheese in it though so i'll probably just leave that for my husband uh for him to eat because yeah <laughs> um and then some more of the uh creamer for my husband two of these marie colander's plant-based uh chicken pot pies i got some more of the vanilla silk almond milk yogurt uh, some French toast cinnamon bites for Jackson. He likes to have those like maybe two times a week for breakfast. And then I got three bags of these organic sliced strawberries. I actually ordered the large bag and they were out of it. So they gave me three of the smaller bags and they gave me organic. So that's fine. I love to shop organic, especially for things like this, but it's usually super expensive. So I'm glad that they actually gave me those instead. <laughs> um, the kind frozen bars these are so good you guys i really really enjoyed these so i got another pack of the mint chocolate almond ones and then i got two boxes of this fully cooked bacon for jackson um again he is not vegan so he eats what he wants to eat um i got a thing of paper plates and then this dawn dish soap as well um i'm trying to steer more towards more natural cleaning products and I have a bunch of dish soap but my husband refuses to use it he wants to use the dawn so that's what we're stuck with uh for now anyway anyway guys that is everything that we got from uh Walmart grocery delivery and then here in a couple seconds I'm going to show you it'll be in the same video um I'm going to show you guys what we got from Harris Teeter again I don't get produce from Walmart anymore because yeah they're terrible at picking produce. So anyway, guys. 
Okay, hey, welcome back. So, this is everything that we got from Harris Teeter today. I went in there really just for vegetables. I feel like I bought the whole produce department <laughs> out. But, um, yeah, so this is everything that we got from Harris Teeter. We actually went to a little wellness shop in town as well and got a few things, but um, I'm not going to show that in this video, I don't think. But anyway, I got two big bunches of kale. Their kale always looks fantastic. Jackson loves kale. My husband loves kale. I love kale. Um, got some Brussels sprouts this time. They look nice and dark and good. Some mushrooms. I got four avocados. These avocados are humongous. Um, so I got four of those. I got four peaches for Jackson. I got some bananas. I got some yellow ones here and then some green ones in the back there, uh, to ripen up. I got some of this organic, uh, romaine lettuce and then a thing of organic baby spinach down there as well. We've got some watermelon here. Watermelon's in season right now. Jackson loves watermelon. Some organic strawberries. Um, of course, they're starting to go out of season, but they still are pretty good. Jackson wanted some corn, so I got some corn on the cob for him. I got these uh, portobello mushrooms. These are really good for like mushroom steaks. I got more of the falafel balls. I really enjoyed these. I thought they were really good um, the other day when I made them, so pick more of those up. I got two packs of organic blueberries. These are also going out of season right now, but they still look pretty good this time, so I went ahead and grabbed two of those. I got a pack of this organic uh, croutons for salads and then some organic vegetable stock back there. This Hidden Valley Ranch, uh, the plant-powered one, is really good. You guys should try it if you have not. It's really good if you like ranch. Um, two things of organic tomato sauce and then two things of the Chobani uh, plain oat milk. That's our favorite one. We like to use it in cereal and stuff. And then the Builder Bars were on sale. And there's an, also an Ibotta um, for these. So I went ahead and picked up four of these. I think there were four for five. So I got two of the Chocolate Mint, which is my favorite one. And then one of this um, almond one. And then one of the Peanut Butter Crunch as well to try out. I've never had the Peanut Butter one. So my husband wanted some chocolate. And I saw this Endangered Species Chocolate. Um, the Caramel Sea Salt and Dark Chocolate one sounded really good. And then this Hazelnut toffee and dark chocolate as well um these do have milk in them because they have toffee uh, but they do have other ones that are vegan um jackson he wanted some kit kats i told him it was fine they were on sale i think they're three for five um anyway we got some snow peas some carrots some vinegar here and then some toilet paper and that is it you guys for everything that we got today uh, this was Harris Teeter and then everything else that we got from Walmart. I hope you all enjoy this video. Stay tuned for more and we'll see you next time. Bye guys.